In Las Cruces, it's a different education story that has some parents and educators feeling shortchanged. New Mexico Governor Susana Martinez says she's expanding the state's early pre-K pilot program by more than $3 million. It's a story ABC7 reporter Jamie Warren is working on in Las Cruces today. She is live tonight with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom. Jamie? We're going to sell those additional funds are providing 174 extra children here in Las Cruces, a place to play and a place to learn. But some schools are still like here on Alpha weren't able to expand. We were here today as kids ran around and played games on the playgrounds at Alpha Schools, which provides early pre-K education. The school's director tells us last year they received funding to provide a free education to 16 three-year-olds. Over 60, though, are on a waiting list. Despite being prepared to bring in more kids, the additional funding ran out. Application for this request for proposal um, were received and competitively scored with some prioritization given to designated investment zone areas. Um, you know, unfortunately, CYP received more applications for funding than, you know, the amount of funds that were available. Therefore, we were not able to fund all applicants. As spokesman Henry Varela says that CYFD gave priority to schools which were smaller and may have had a lower accountability rating, but were overall prepared to start a pre-K program for the very first time. Reporting live in Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile News.